ah, 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 surrender, Gru. I am here to take all of your minions. Oh, wow. I am shaking in my boots. It's cockroach boy. Look, Jerry. It's a huge cockroach. <laughs> I am not a huge cockroach. I am Maxime. Looks like a huge cockroach to me. Ah, uh, that's it. I'm going to zap you with my cockroach zapper. How's that for cockroach boy? See, what did I tell you? It's a huge cockroach with tiny cockroaches. <laughs> oh, come on, Jerry. Go inside the transformation chamber. Oh. Yes, yes, go right there. It's the transformation machine. All right, this is going to take long. I haven't got all day, Gru. I'll just put the stone in the chamber cap. Turn the knob just slightly to the right. Now go, Jerry. Jump into the chamber. Oh. Any day now. Just hold on a second, cockroach boy. Then we push the dial back to the left. And then we press down on the left lever three times. One, two, three. And now the right lever. Oh, ho, oh, oh, Jerry, what happened to you? You look like a smushed Skittle. <laughs> Looks like a crushed cookie. Oh, yeah, well, my crushed Skittle can smush your cockroaches any day. <laughs> oh, told you so. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh boy, smushed Skittle Jerry, come on, let's go and fix you up. It's the Despicable Me 4 spinning wheel game. Despicable Me 4 is coming out July 3rd. Let's meet our players. First up, we have the cute Gru Jr. Yes, Gru has a baby this time. Next, the transformation chamber is making Mega Minions. We have Mega Tim. Here's Mega Jerry. He looks like a smushed Skittle or a crushed cookie, but he's ultra strong. Here's our bad guy of Despicable Me 4. It's Maxime or Cockroach Boy. Here's Mega Mel. He has a laser beam eye. And Mega Dave. He looks super strong. Here's AVL agent Gus. He's an anti-villain league spy. And of course, our villain doesn't work by himself. He has his friend Valentina, who's villain number two. Here's Poppy Prescott. It's Gru and Lucy's neighbor. Looks like she's helping them out. And finally, our mega minion is Banana Gus. He's a banana superhero that can actually fly. We don't have teams this time, so the player we land on last is the winner. So let's start with round number one. Here we go. We landed on Mega Jerry, our crushed Skittle minion. We're going to use our trusty little hammer to break out the surprises in each of these circles. So let's see what Jerry's brought us. One, two, three. Here's a mini collectible plush from Despicable Me 4. And we have a Despicable Me 4 minifigure. Oh, but that's not it. We have a super gooey Mega Minion Dave. He's supposed to have marble filling inside. Oh, whoa, he's so squishy. He's supposed to stretch three times his size. Here he is, whoa, Stretch Armstrong. And the beads feel really cool on the inside. Can you hear them? It sounds like crushed ice. And here he is, so strong and so wobbly. You can smush him, squeeze him, or stretch him. Whee! Now let's see what little mini plush we get. They come in mini transformation chambers like the big one we have. Let's see who it is. Which one of our AVL minion agents has turned into a Mega Minion? Oh, there he is. It's Mega Minion Dave. Urgh. He's stretching his muscles. Now let's see our minifigure. Oh, it's so tiny. <laughs> it's our little banana hero, Gus. And is he using toot power? 
I think he's using his fart power to fly away. <laughs> here are all the ones we can get in the collector's guide. It's Mega Gus right over here. We're on round two. Let's go. We landed on AVL Agent Gus. Here's Agent Gus. Let's check out what he's brought us. One, two, three. Oh, he's super strong, even without being in the transformation chamber. Let's try again. One, two, three. We have a little seedling. What is this? It's Securities. Here's another Despicable Me 4 Mini Minion. Oh, here's a chunky one. It's huge. We have some tiny tins with real working stationery. And there's more. We have a Dino Strike Ice Age. Oh, but hang on a minute. I hear something. It's a bird. It's a plane. Nope, it's just Mega Minion Gus. Launch and crash Mega Minion Gus. Here's his little launcher. We have a suction cup on the bottom. We can stick it anywhere. Here's Mega Minion Gus. He's got his little cape and his superhero mask on. We take his little launcher, put him on here just like that. Oh, hello, Mega Minion Gus. Looks like we have a cockroach infestation. Would you please handle that for me? I'll see you later. You cannot defeat me with a banana group. Yeah! Stinky banana! <laughs> Let's take a look at these little tiny tins. I love this little rock candy pen. That is so adorable. Look at that. Check out this cute little accessory. It says, sweet, what's inside here? We have a little notebook. It's all sweets themed. Lots of blank pages for us to write in. And we also have this cute little candy accessory with a little heart inside. Here's our tin. If you shake it around, you can hear that there's a surprise inside. And we also have these confettis on the front. What is our surprise? Whoa, this is big. Is this a pencil sharpener? Oh, it's a little tape dispenser. We have some pretty tape. Let's add it to our notebook. And now we can write with our pen. What color is it? Let's check our little rock candy pen out. Oh, it's a pretty hot pink. Let's draw a little heart on there. And we can place all of our cute little accessories back inside our tin. And we can attach it wherever we want. Next, let's check out our Minions minifigure. Oh, this one's paper wrapped. This one might be a special one. Oh, it's one of our AVL agents. Who is it? He was special. It's AVL Minion. I think this is Stuart. And he's a rare. Now let's see what little security we have. Grow a smile. Look, we've got a little mushroom sticking out of here already. Okay. Let's go ahead and open this up. Oh, it comes out of the soil just like that. And look at that. It has a little mushroom on its head. What is this? Is it a little chicken? It's got beans on the bottom. It's like a little beanie baby. We have Irene. They all have little mushrooms on the top of their heads. And now we get to build a dinosaur. Here we go. This one might be a different dinosaur. Oh, neat. It has a spring on the inside. So we can move our dinosaur. This should be our pieces. Oh, cool, it's a new dinosaur. And each of our dinosaurs have armor and slimy, gooey Ice Age slime. Let's go ahead and add this leg to this side. That looks right. And this leg to this side. Let's add his tail and it's movable. Whoa, when we move the tail, it opens its mouth. The fins on the side of his head keep breaking off. So I don't know how we're gonna keep those on. Here's the second one. Let's see if we can keep it on. At least it's on there for now. And here is his mouth guard. It's his armor. And now he's ready to be slimed. Here's some stretchy Ice Age slime. Let's keep going with round number three. Who will we land on? We landed on Poppy Prescott. She's Gru's teenage neighbor and she's helping out the minions. Is she Agnes, Edith, and Margot's babysitter? We'll find out in the movie. One, two, three. Oh, she's strong. <laughs> she is a strong hero. We have an inside out two minifigure, more minions minifigures, 
and a Despicable Me 4 plush. Which plush figure have we got this time? Oh, we've got a duplicate! It's Mega Dave! Let's see what Inside Out 2 minifigure we have. Here are the ones we can get. We don't have Lance Slash Blade or the Deep Dark Secret. And I know what the Deep Dark Secret is. If you've watched it, you have to wait all the way until the credits at the end are over and then the Deep Dark Secret comes out and says what the Deep Dark Secret is. And it's hilarious. So let's see, do we have Deep Dark Secret in here? Hopefully we do. Oh, we got Lance Slash Blade. He's Riley's favorite video game character. And his special attack is less than cool. What's our Despicable Me 4 minifigure? Oh, it's a new one. Oh, it's a minion reading something. It's AVL Tim, and he's rare. Let's try to get Poppy or Baby Gru. Here we go with the next round. We landed on Mega Tim. Okay, Mega Tim, what have you got for us? One, two, three. Another Minions plush. Minions minifigure. Oh, what is this? It's some kind of pole with a bear on it. What is in here? It's Mega Minion Tim with his super stretchy noodly arms. But that's not his only trick. Let's keep going. Looks like we have one more thing in here. It's a Mariah Elizabeth mini mystery plush. Wait a second, wait a second, that wasn't it. We have a Gujitsu stretchy Mega Minion Tim. This one is gel filled. Uh oh, here comes Cockroach Boy again. I can't believe I was defended by little bananas. I'm so upset. Where's Gru? What do you want, little Twinkie? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, little Twinkie, I'm out of here. <laughs> and we can also place this pole in his hands. Bye-bye. And he can throw it around. Whoa, look at his arms go. Time for Gujitsu Tim. Let's see what the gel-filled one feels like. Here he is. Oh, I like the gel-filled one way better. This is so cool and soft. It feels like there's slime in there. Whoa, he's so stretchy. And he can stretch his arms even more. Even his little hands are filled with goo. Let's see our plushy figure. Will we get something new this time? Oh, it's Mega Mel. He's got a laser beam eye. Next up, we're checking out another minifigure. And this one's wrapped up. Whoa, that's three rares in a row. Is it a new one? It's a new one. It's Silly Jerry. Oh, no, he's not rare. And it's not Jerry, it's Ron. He's just a common. Which little plushie will we get? Oh, it's a little cupcake sprinkled one. Let's check out the collector's guide. Who is this? It's Cupie. All right, round five. The last person better not be Cockroach Boy or his friend. Here we go. It's Mega Gus. Here's Mega Banana Gus. One, two, three. He brought us a pet rescue ball. And what else? It's an Adopt Me mystery pet. Something else. We've got a minifigure. Anything else? Nope, nothing else in there. Five magic reveal and heal surprises to find. Which little pet will we rescue? Sounds like fun. Okay, it's like the five surprise balls. Let's check out our little pet. Here's our collector's guide. Let's try this first slice here. Oh, we have some band-aids and some medicine. What's the next one? Oh, we're building something. These are the legs to our ball. Let's first check this slice out. We have a little doggy cone. Here is our little puppy. How sweet. He's got a collar and two little broken hearts on the back. Let's make our puppy a pet bed. We'll attach these legs to the side of the ball. Now we have a little pet bed, but we're supposed to help our little puppy. The broken hearts on the back means he's sad. So we're gonna go ahead and add some water and maybe our puppy needs a bath. Here's a little puppy bath. Oh yeah, it's washing out. Look at his little bath water. Let's go ahead and help him out. Wash all the sadness away. He 
go, our little puppy's happy now. Now we can give our little puppy some medicine so he can feel better. Here we go, you won't feel anything. The little puppy did so good. Let's go ahead and give him a Band-Aid. Here we go. And now our little puppy can wear his puppy cone. This will keep him from licking any boo-boo spots so that it could heal and get better. All right, now that we took care of our little puppy, let's see what little animal we have in this Adopt Me egg. Find the Chase Golden Dragon. Here's our egg, it's orange. Now we're going to use our little pet bed because we need to put our egg in water before we hatch it. Let's add some more water on top. Whoa, okay, all the paint's coming off. I think it's a yellow egg. Wait, wait a minute, wait. Oh, there's something on the bottom. Cool, it looks like a jungle egg. Now let's see what's inside. It's our little bullfrog. Our bullfrog is a common. And here's our minion's minifigure. Oh, cute. Who's this? It's got a little bell on the inside too. Yep, it is a party minion. We've got the chase, so it's pretty rare. We're on round six, and we didn't land on baby Gru yet. Here we go. We landed on Mega Jerry again. So whenever we land on a repeat, we're just gonna spin again. We landed on Mega Mel. Mega Mel needs to learn to control his mega powers. One, two, three. We have something ginormous in here. It's a mini fart blaster. Let's try this out. Oh my goodness. On the back here, we have a fartometer. We have a squeaker, a poofer, tooter, stinker, loud and proud, let it rip, sonic boom, and clear the room. The little minion's face says it all. That one definitely sounds like a clear the room. <laughs> what else did we have in there? It's Mega Mel with his laser beam eye. And another minifigure. What? Another one? How many Twinkies are there? <laughs> Here's our minifigure. Ah, so some of them we have wrapped up, and I think this is the only one that we don't have wrapped up, and it's a duplicate. It's a Mega Gus. Round seven. Oh, so close. We landed on Valentina, but we still haven't landed on Maxime. Hopefully he's not the last player. That would make him the winner. One, two, three. We did it. We've got a cutie cuff, some more minions, and a minion plush. We've got our crushed Skittle Jerry, Mega Jerry. Here's our minion mystery mini. It's AVL Minion. Let's check out our cutie cuff. This one is Hello Kitty and Friends themed. Oh, neat, this one's so cute. I think it's Hello Kitty or it's My Melody with red. It is, it's My Melody, but she's not pink. So cutie cuffs, all you do is get it on your wrist like this. And then your little cute friend is hugging your arm. We have three players left. It's cute little baby Gru, Maxime the villain, and Mega Dave. We're on round number eight. Who will be the last player? Well, it's not Mega David, because we just landed on him. One, two, three. Mega David brought us an inside out two minifigure, a real littles backpack, and another minion minifigure. Here's our cute little kitty cat backpack. Here is the first surprise. It's inside this little baggie. We have a kitty cupcake themed notebook. We have some kitty cupcake stickers and a matching little cupcake pencil and our back clip. We can add some of these cute stickers inside of our notebook. We can do that on the first page right here. And we'll add a cupcake and this little kitty with a cherry on top. Let's see if we have the deep dark secret in this inside out box. That's all we're missing. Oh, I don't think we've got them because I've seen little Envy's eyes poking through. And for our Minions minifigure, who are we getting? Oh, this Minion looks so sad and it's got a party hat on. Is that corn or a pineapple in his hand? Only two players left. It's Maxime and Baby Gru. We're gonna need some thumbs up magic to land on Maxime this round. Here we go. Whoa, no way, we landed on Maxime. That means
means he's not the winner. One, two, three. We've got a minion minifigure and a Gujitsu AVL Tim. He's also got a water blaster. Let's open him up and check out his water blaster. Here he is. Oh, this is a different type of gel. Okay, this one actually looks like it has white gel inside. It feels like clay. It feels harder than our Mega Tim. You can see that it's clear. You can't see the gel inside. Let's stretch him out. Oh, he's not as stretchy as Mega Minion Tim, but his arms are noodly and stretchy. All right, here's his water blaster. Oh, even his water blaster squishy. Whoa, it really works. Here's our Minions minifigure. What was in here? Do we have, we have a new little party minion. It's the one with the star glasses. It's Party Dave and he's a common. And Baby Gru is our winner. Our cutest little winner of all. Let's do a tiny little baby poke for little Gru and see what he's brought us. We have some Insta Poodles, some more Minions minifigures and a Mariah Elizabeth plush. Uh-oh, wait a second. I knew that wasn't it. Whoa! Baby Gru brought us an extreme ultimate fart blaster with real fart smells. We have a fart smell and a banana scent. It's the biggest fart blaster ever. Whoa, neat, it even projects an image of the minion. Blast real rings and get a whiff. All right, we've got to try it. Whoa, this thing is huge. Look at it. So let's see how we get the fart smell in here. Our projector comes out from over here and the fart rings come out from over here. It smells like popcorn. If we turn the lights off, we can see the minion being projected. Now it's time for some less stinky surprises. It's Pickles! He's so extra soft and plushy. Pickles is one cute little dinosaur. Now let's make some Insta Poodles. So we have our little chopsticks. Let's take off the lid and we remove this part also. And these, oh, there we go. We have our little noodles in there. Now let's get some water in here and watch this fizz up. It's bubbling. We can use our little chopsticks to help our Insta Poodles out. There's one. Here's one little puppy. It looks like it's a party puppy. She's got a party hat on. Here's another little puppy with a bow on. We've got more. Here's a little poodle. This little one looks like she likes the garden. And here's another cute little fluffy one. Is there more? Okay, so I don't see any more just yet, but we have something else in here. One of them has a royal throne. And this little thing right here is its home. All of our little Insta Poodles get to live in this little home. It's a poodle palace. And our last surprise is our Minions minifigure. We have this one, it's a duplicate. And it's the end of our show. Here's everything we got this Mega Minion spinning wheel game. And until next time, I will see you later. Bye for now.